Hi, this is Sai Morton with the daily update on Eurofix. I post my exclusive market overviews with the key political and economical events, charts and important levels on the Forex Pisami.com forum weekly. This short video is a response to rapidly changing situation of the currency markets and should help you to stand top of the game and be profitable. I suggest you to visit ForexPisami.com forum and read my analysis for the week before watching this daily video. Welcome everybody, let's take a look again on your currency or better to say let's take a look at the parallel view on the euro currency and great british pound because on the cable we also have the setup that we discussed recently so it has, for, it has shown the first reaction but uh, right now it's uh, some, some continuation could happen and if we'll take a look at the full time from chart of the euro currency and great british pound it's mostly very similar there are some minor differences exist, but uh, in general, the shape is very uh, similar on both currencies. So first of all, in your currency, you can see that finally some reaction has started because it's really a strong support here is major weekly 618 support. It's accompanied with the daily and weekly oversold. So that's why this pullback is just uh, obviously should happen here, although there are some Concern degree exists around the, 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 the final destination point of this pullback. Theoretically, it might be very small. As you can see, for example, situation very similar to this one, where after the strong sell-off, market dropped in the oversold, but the pullback was really small. So theoretically, here's might be the same. Uh, even I suppose that here is probably the distance almost the same. So right from here. Right there, so you can see right, so it's approximately the same scale with downside harmonic action. But anyway, uh, we will go step by step, and first we're trying to uh, do everything that we could with the first harmonic retracement here, and then we will see. So if market will start to show that it might be some second leg upward retracement in the shape of the A B C D, well, uh, we will keep going with this retracement. If not, then probably we will be possessed for a possible downward action because uh, the downside continuation now is a question of time because not as a uh, weekly tar uh, target XOP has not been hit yet as the monthly COP so also has not been touched. So then both of them stands very close to the current market and uh, market should go lower and to complete the extensions that we have on high time frames. On the fall time frame chart, market almost has reached the level that we have specified, not quite, so it, it could climb slightly higher. As we have the actually, the top was around 1370 uh, area, while the confidence stands around 1390, it's 8795 area. So it means that here's maybe some minor upward continuation could happen, especially if you take a look. Uh, here's was recently we, we have some this acceleration, so. Uh, it, 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 it means that chances to see another minor upward continuation while market will hit the major level are really significant. Anyway, the feature of this level remains the same uh, because it works like our uh, brand body like trade. So it's not quite the brand body because you can see lots of candles above the 3x3. Three three. Here's we have minor interruption of the thrust. But in general, with the strong downside thrusting action overall sentiment in the market, we think that here's enough momentum to trigger at least 618 retracement on this upper action. So from that standpoint, this is, let's call it not the brand body, but momentum trade, something of that sort. So uh, potentially, as I said, if it will be another second leg of the upper bound, so it will be somewhere like that. So market will show some pullback here, maybe 50%, zero currency likes the 50% level. And then we might be next upward continuation, upward uh, leg. So maybe market even will already test the trend line. It's has been broken, so this also is possible. But currently we're dealing with this setup. Now our task is to consider possible taking the short position here. Uh, and at least it should be the 618 pullback. So second hour task is to move stops to the break even once the up downward action will start. So that is what we would like to get on um, your currency right now on the fall time from chart. 
If we take a look at our recent setup on the phone, on a cable, take a look, here's the same story. Market is coming to the confidence level. OP has not been quite reached, so it's just a few pips market hasn't quite reached the OP. If you have taken the short position recently uh, a bit earlier, so as you can see here, this reaction was actually good, very good. So that's okay. It's uh, no problem with this, but currently let's take a look at market is forming the triangle, right? So triangle it is a clear bullish continuation pattern and uh, potentially we could, you could get here another butterfly inside of this triangle. So in the moment of the breakout, so you can see market could reach the uh, 3526, 3520 area complete 1618 of the butterfly and form potential reversal pattern right at the point where we have the OP destination point it's right here 3515 so it's just 5 pip difference uh, between the targets on the hourly chart and the volatile chart so overall setup is still valid because you can see the confidence rather uh, wide here and uh, uh, if you have, have made some pips recently on this pullback, sorry, on this pullback, that's great. So it also was proper reaction actually on this um, pattern. So now market is going a bit higher. The same story might be on uh, your currency. So here market hasn't quite reached the confidence. Besides, take a look on the hourly chart. <clears throat> this market has exceeded slightly the OP area and shows very minor reaction. So it means that Maybe market will start to show a bit high action. Anyway, for taking the short position at this point, it also will be welcome to wait for some uh, bearish reversal pattern. Maybe minor head and shoulders will be formed here. Maybe some other pattern uh, that could uh, definitely point us and tells that market is preparing for downside action. So currently at this point, we have these levels. It's around 113.18, 113.05, but if market will move slightly higher, they also will move slightly higher. So just uh, keep on keep an eye on them. Um, that's actually all, all that we have currently on the euro currency and on the Gabriel British pound on the forex market. So let's keep watching for progress here and uh, see what reaction will follow from the confidence areas as on the euros on the cable.